Hello um, and welcome to what I'm calling a vlog -a day video, I guess. I don't know really. Um, we are off camping and with the summer holidays, my podcasting schedule has been completely out the window and it's been nearly a month. So I thought you might in all enjoy a little insight into our camping holiday. Um, we've got the car all packed up. It's very packed up. The boys are kind of divided in the back there. <laughs> um, I'm just waiting for Tom to sort a couple of bits out in the house before we head off. Um, but we are off to Loch Lomond for three nights and then up to Aviemore for three nights. Um, so hopefully we'll have lots of lovely scenery. Um, we're planning on doing a few walks. Sorry, my arm is shaking already. <laughs> we're planning on doing a few walks and things like that. So we thought we would take you along with us for the holiday and you can kind of have a few of the sights of Scotland. <laughs> can you not strap yourself in because of all the bags? I'll come and help you in a second. <laughs> the car's really well packed. <laughs> We're here. We're set up. We're in a tent. I don't know if you can hear me because it is tipping it down. I said it was going to be a weekend of rain. The boys are just sat on their little chairs over there. Arthur is already using technology when we're supposed to be outside playing and having fun. But yeah, it's a bit wet. I'll see if I can show you. It may be absolutely tipping it down with rain. But that is not a bad view from our tent, is it? <laughs> we are literally just here. Fantastic view over Loch Lomond. If only it would stop raining. Good morning. Um, it is our first proper day um, out camping. You can see the beautiful loch behind me. In fact, just behind me there, that's kind of our campsite if you can see behind my head. <laughs> um, today we are just taking a little walk around the lock and we're going to get a little ferry out to one of the islands. I think it's called something like Inch, Inch Calier or Inch, I don't know, I can't completely can't remember. I will let you know when I can see it. Um, but yeah, not too bad sleep. Boys went to sleep about 10 and woke up about half six typically, but not too bad and it seems a lot drier today. I will show you some of the views throughout our day. I can't pronounce it. This is the island we're on and we're heading up this path in the rain and you can just about see our ferry motoring away. <laughs> and just in case you were wondering where Jazzy got to, he's here looking soggy. <laughs> What's in there? There's some cards. Yeah. <laughs> what else? 
While we were on the island, soaking wet, we had to go and pick up the geocache that was on the island because you know you never know when you get a chance to do those ones again. It's taken us ages to find and we are absolutely drenched. But Arthur is very, very happy to have found the geocache. <laughs> Jazzy, on the other hand, has gone to sleep. Oh, the chaos is getting in. Okay then, before we get completely... It's brightened up a bit, which is lovely. Um, we are just waiting for the ferry back over to... And in fact... Oh no, I'm not sure if I can see it coming. Anyway, we're just waiting for the ferry back over to um, the, the mainland, I guess, from the centre of the lock. Um, and yeah, the, it's brightened up. I think our campsite is just kind of... Oops, there's that bit over there, if you can see. So we have actually got to walk all the way back along to our campsite now. Um, Arthur is doing really, really well, but he is getting tired, bless him. Good morning. It is day two of our time in Loch Lomond. There's Tom. <laughs> and we are attempting this morning to walk up to um, Ben Lomond with the boys. It's about an eight mile round trip up to the top um, and back. But yeah, we'll see how we get on. I will just show you where we're heading. But all these so, are watching this can hear you. Yeah. So that hill up there with its head in the clouds. Let's see if I can zoom you in a bit. That one there is where we are heading. Wish us luck. Where are we, buddy? Yeah. Okay. We're very, very close to the top, aren't we? Yeah. But we've run out of time. Yeah. And we're gonna have to head back home. Yeah. Are you are you enjoying being on you enjoying you enjoying being on Ben Lomond? Yeah. Can you stand up and give me a pose?
is the noise of the boys playing in the background. <laughs> um, yeah, hopefully I will have got some footage. Um, but unfortunately, my battery died and we didn't have anywhere to charge at um, Loch Lomond. So I've got what footage I could do. But yeah, we're heading up to Abbey Moor right now. Um, and then we just need to set up camp this afternoon. And we've got another couple of days up there to enjoy all the sights up there. Here we are then, all set up at campsite number two, our home for three nights. Completely different, um, not got much of a view because it's kind of mostly forest woods. Car's obviously right next to the pitch, but hey, toilet box are just there and we haven't got anyone opposite us at the moment. So it's quite nice and secluded, which is nice. Boys are just <laughs> doing a bit of colouring, maybe fighting over a bit of colouring. And Tom is cooking some tea with a glass of wine, I hope. And it's so beautiful today. We're walking along and so Not sure if you managed to understand what Arthur was saying, but we are doing a sculpture trail today. The Frank Bruce Sculpture Trail up near Aviemore. Um, so there's lots of kind of tree sculptures by the sound of it. Um, and as it says, they're created from Scots pine from this forest and our first sculpture is just over here let's see if I can walk and show you without falling down a rabbit hole that would make amusing vlogging wouldn't it I think we might have worn out the boys. <laughs> it's just coming up to eight o'clock in the morning and they're both still fast asleep. Also, look at that little bed thief. We are off on what we're calling an exciting day today for the boys. They have no idea where we're going. Arthur is trying to come up with ideas. What do you think? Where do you think we're going? You think we're going to a soft play, do you? We just told him we were going to town to do some shopping and he thought that was really boring, didn't you? <laughs> so you have to wait and see. Are you excited though?
Say that again. Where is it? Should we go find some other ones? Yeah, that one. I don't know, but it's gonna eat you. Right, Arthur, show me the spotter's guide. What have you got? I've got that one and that one. Oh, wow. Well, what about up here? What are on here? Come on, put the coin in. <laughs> 